I don't understand. Like, I think it's a generational thing because when I was growing up, people that had tattoos, like, like you didn't go trick-or-treating at their house. You know what I mean? It was like a radical thing. It was like, oh my God, she lives by herself, has 45 cats and a tattoo. Like, it was like... But now it's like they have the whole sleeve. Like, what are you going to do when you're, you're 85 years old and your entire arm is tattooed and your grandkids are like, Grandma, is that a bear on your arm? No, honey, it's a snake. Let me show you. <laughs> Another joke that'll make it to the album because it's a visual. Anyway, so... Um, no. So uh, what, what I don't understand, like the neck tattoos, like where do people with neck tattoos work? Seriously, there's no more Blockbuster. Where the fuck do they get jobs? <laughs> Dwayne Reed, thank you very much. Um, I'll check that out. So Henry is always saying to me, like, he's like, oh, he loves to torture me. Comes home, uh, spring break. He's like, mommy, I just want to let you know I'm getting a tattoo. I'm like, you're not getting a tattoo. I'm getting a tattoo. I'm, mommy, I'm 21. I can do whatever I want. That's my favorite sentence. Mommy, I'm 21. I can do whatever I want. I'm like, you're not getting a tattoo. Yeah, I am. No, you're not. Yeah, I am. No, you're not. Yeah, I am. No, I said, all right, fine. What are you going to get? Give me one good... He's like, well, you know, I have a couple ideas. Um, I said, all right, give me one good idea. He's like, well, I want something New York-y. I said, all right. I swear to God. I said, all right, well, like what? He's like, well, I'm thinking of getting our zip code 10025 tattooed on my arm. I said, Henry, you're a Jew. You're not getting numbers tattooed on your arm. <laughs> the fuck is the matter with you? Thank you guys so much. Get home safe. Good night, everybody.